Okay, in this video I will show you how to get rid of unnecessary tags in MemoQ when working with Word documents. So here I have a Word document in the doc format that looks like this. It's a quite ordinary looking Word document. And uh, what I will do, I will save it in the docx format. And this is because I have been led to believe that docx is a better and a more suitable format for MemoQ. So now I will save it in and choose the docx format and I will change the name to docx and I will add tag ridden and you will soon see why. So now I have my uh, docx and uh, which looks exactly the same. I will close it and I will switch to MemoQ and in MemoQ I will import this docx document. Okay, now I will open it for translation. And here I can see if I go a little bit, the beginning looks okay. But if I go a little bit further from segment number 26, I have a number of RPR tags that are there for no good reason, at least as far as I can see. So there are a number of them, about a dozen of them until the end. And the question is, how can I get rid of these tags? Uh, I could of course use the edit uh, segment function F2, but I feel it's a little bit uh, risky. So what I will do instead, since I know that it starts with since 2011 until the end, I will close this document. I will go back to Word. I will open the document again and uh, I will go to the point where tags start to occur, which is here. And I will select the entire text and I will cut this. And I will paste it back as unformatted, like this. And I had taken note of the fact that I had uh, three portions of text that were in bold. So one name here, I will add it as bold manually. And here I had uh, safety first was also bold. So I add it like this. And I had a, th a second name here and I would put it in bold. So it's quite easy if the formatting is uh, not very complicated. So now I have the same document and I will save it again, this time with a new name and the new name will be no tags and you will see why. Save and I will close it. Now I go back to MemoQ and I will import this new document, so the one with no tags in the name. And if I open it for translation and I go to segment 26, I can see that from segment 26 until the end, I no longer have any tags. Or actually I have one new tag, which is a bookmark, and this kind of tags, they can be safely uh, deleted uh, directly in MemoQ. So I can press F2 like this and backspace twice. And now I got rid of this unnecessary tag. So that was a low tech way to get rid of unnecessary tags in a docx document. Now I want to add that uh, Studio 2011, in fact, performs much better with the same document. So if I open my same tag ridden document in Studio, I will get this. 
And if I go to segment uh, 26, which was since uh, 2011, and uh, to the end, I uh, will see that there isn't a single tag in Studio. So somehow Studio manages to import the same document uh, much better than uh, MemoQ does. That's a hint to the Kigre people, do improve your DocX filter.